Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Frozen Fears is up next and thinking about what I said last part of there potentially being a secret exit in here, I don't really think so. I mean, where is the secret exit going to lead to on the map? Is it going to lead you in the lava? I don't think so. Is it going to lead you up to that pipe on a totally other level? I don't think so. <laughs> so anyway, let's just start the level and I guess see if there is a secret exit. Oh god, yeah, this one. I don't like the background of this. Ugh, look at that. It's just... It's dizzying. <laughs> okay, focus on the foreground only. Just do not look at the background whatsoever. I know saying... Not to look at the background makes you want to look at the background, but I assure you, you do not want to look at the background. <laughs> it's probably a power-up in that box. There is. I figured there would be because it's kind of out of the way. But anyway, as for, uh, as I said, oh shoot, as for uh, secret exits, uh, there isn't a secret exit in every level of a ghost house, even in the original Super Mario World, so... Yeah, I shouldn't always assume that there's going to be a secret exit when there's a ghost house just by like instinct or something like that, so... Yeah, I can't... I, I, I can't get through that gauntlet, at least not safely. So I gotta wait for the booze to go around again. Come on guys, good boys. So oh, This could be bad with my Xbox D-pad. <laughs> Every other one, preferably. Just to take out the issues of potentially having to deal with more, I mean, less having to press up is more. <laughs> yeah, I should always be spin jumping here too, by the way. Because ghosts, they can't hurt you when you're spin jumping. Well, if you spin jump on them. Whoa, 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 And it's slippery too, by the way, if you didn't know to that. <laughs> Yeah, midpoints. Yeah. Oh, and a cape. Yes. Oh, there's a block there, but the background remains. Dang it. And there's a ceiling. It's good to know in case I accidentally jump to my doom by hitting the ceiling. Yeah, a cape. Really, really nice here. Let me guess, that thing bounces always in a direction that's in your way? No, I guess not. Okay. Oh, shoot. Lost the cape. That was a good thing to have here. Uh-oh. 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 Shoot! <laughs> I panicked. I seen it coming my way, and I panicked. Those jumps weren't hard. I just panicked. That looks like I'm doing this capeless, unless I go back to the uh, top secret area. Maybe. Nah, we'll see how things go this way. Because it looks like it's just going to be uh, a mostly platforming level. And I didn't see that block again. It's hidden behind um, the numbers. <laughs> okay, there we go. Alright, yeah, it's not, it's not that difficult. It's just a matter of picking your moments. Go, 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 go. Yeah, I think that's better if I just rush that particular segment before the boo lasers get in a spot that gives you issues. By the way, boo blocks, they move just like regular boos when your back is turned towards towards them. You gotta kind of lead them to you. When you jump at them, uh, they turn back into a block, so don't really worry about them hurting you or anything like that. They're just a fake moving platform, I guess you could say. I mean, you know, more than an actual enemy. Why are these vines floating in midair? <laughs> Guess even the vines are haunted in this place. Fire flower does not help me. <laughs> Going down. Okay, we are doing fairly well, despite ice physics and tricky jumps. Oh boy! <laughs> All right, wow, it's over. Already? Yeah, I don't think there's a secret exit in there. Like, where would they hide a secret exit in there? <laughs> well, they do give you a cape, so maybe there's a place to fly up to, but... 
I'm gonna assume there isn't the secret exit. Anyway, I did Koopa Lake 2 in the last part because I did stuff out of order because I wasn't sure if there was a secret exit here. So that level is done, this level is done, so let's move on to Freeze Flame Rock. Oh, the awesome music returns. You gonna split? Okay, you're not gonna split. <laughs> I was worried if you're gonna split or jump. The thing about those jumping chucks is that you don't know if they're gonna do a split when they crouch down and look like they have cramps, or if they're going to, um, uh, or if they're going to jump. Jump or split is what I'm saying, because they can split into three. Oh, you can go in there. I guess this is the, this is the freeze flame parts of, whoa, 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 part of the place, but I'm used to ice by now. <laughs> What's ice doing in the final world anyway? I suppose ice is probably one of the most difficult obstacles, such as the difficult as ugh, aspects of a platformer, so I guess it is final world material, so it does make sense in a way. I mean, it can be done in uh What did I miss? <laughs> oh, no, 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 you're kidding me. Oh, man. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Uh, yeah, the um, uh, ice phys physics can be used in early game levels, and and it was used in early game levels, but it but it has a lot of potential to cause you issues. Whoa, must have spawned it. <laughs> but it ha has potential to cause a lot of issues in uh, uh, later levels because you have to really control your jumps well. And I'd really like to see what's over on this side, if at all possible. Uh, just to see for kicks, because I feel I missed something here. Like, I'm not gonna go in any pipes before I, uh... Um, okay, it's Dragon Coin. Yoshi! 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 Can I go down? No, okay, okay. <laughs> whoa, 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 I jumped the gun there. Uh, I'm gonna have to jump here! <laughs> and... Nope, can't go in there. So that... Was that... Was that path entirely, like, just to get a Yoshi? I wouldn't be... Surprised. Whoa, I didn't think that would be all that well. <sighs> I'm not sure getting a Yoshi is really worth it. Well, I mean, yeah, there's the, the dragon coin to get. But wait, didn't I press down on all the pipes? I'm back at the beginning. What the heck is going on here? <laughs> Dang it. I somehow managed to play this spot twice. <laughs> and even backwards. <laughs> okay, it's... Now, oh, there we go. Yeah, didn't I press down on that pipe? I, I don't know, I'm, I'm second-guessing myself with... That freaking oh well. <laughs> second-guessing is the worst kind of guessing. <laughs> yeah, I'm not really sure getting Yoshi is all the... all very much worth it there. Well, maybe it is. Because you got all these tight jumps. Well, then again, Yoshi could be like a secondary... J oh, shoot, jump too far. Like a secondary jump for this section if things go... Uh, go south on uh, Koopa Jump, but yeah, that's, that's gonna be a, quite an obstacle to get past. Jump over, please, thank you, thank you, good, good boy. <laughs> I could kind of tell that Chuck was going to jump over my head uh, the first time I seen it, because there was a, like a lower alcove to duck into. You know, it's kind of like an indicator that it's it's safe down there. You know, if, if it was gonna split, it isn't safe down there, basically. I mean, it could have been a trap too, but... It wasn't. <laughs> Alright. Press down, there we go. It works. Mm -hmm. Move it, move it, move it. Good boy. I like how the spike tops are despawning for me. Oh, oh no, 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 I want that. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna try and keep Yoshi here to have that. I'm pressing up, I swear. <laughs> to have that extra jump if I need it, but I hope it won't hinder me more than help me. Okay, here we go. <gasps> yeah, I, I didn't even have time to react to uh, bouncing off the, uh, I'm mean, jumping off the Koopa because I ended up catching the corner, so yeah, maybe I'm just gonna ignore uh, the Yoshi, because it's kind of far out of the way and in a rather precarious spot. Yeah. <laughs> well, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'll try Yoshiing it. Maybe like a couple, just a couple of runs, just to see how things go. I guess. Bloop. So yeah. Oop. All right. 
See, I can press down and up. I can. Yeah. What is that purple stuff anyway down below? Like, I'd really like to know. <laughs> like, grape juice, boiling grape juice, pr boiling prune juice. I don't know, but it is harmful, I know that. Dang it! Press up! When I press up! <laughs> Alright, here we go. Hold the jump button ahead of time. Yay! <laughs> I mistimed it, I know. It was my fault. All this is my fault, which kind of makes it even more infuriating. <laughs> but it's okay. I will make it through this eventually. Oh, I assure you. Should I even try getting the Yoshi? I don't know, I'm getting kind of kind of impatient here. <laughs> so I'm just gonna... No, Yoshi would be nice to at least get past the freeze... I mean, the yeah, the frozen part of this area. Because you can... You have that sort of extra hit combined with the automatic spin jump Yoshi has. I should say the automatic spin jump physics Yoshi automatically has. Yeah, Yoshi's jump is like a spin jump, basically. Yep. Go. Haha. -ha. I'm wondering if I should just, like, leave Yoshi behind. Hey, I pressed up! <laughs> it's like I shouldn't be surprised by that, but I am surprised by it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, no! Okay, I'm glad I had a Yoshi there. Nope, no rocks. Oh, midpoint was right here. Good. This looks like it's based off of that uh, one level... I can't stay on that platform, can I? <laughs> it's based off of that uh, one Bowser's Valley level where you have to take Yoshi all the way to the end to lap up a key. You know, that's out of reach. I think that's what it's based off of with the way that these platforms are looking. But anyway, one block jumps. This is a pretty cool uh, looking formation here, by the way. Okay, here we go! Ho ho ho! Okay, it's just a matter of timing. This this sort of jump here is a lot trickier than the rest because you have two ceilings to contend with. <laughs> Wait, was there a ceiling above my head? There? I think there was. Good to know. There usually usually isn't a ceiling, but it's good to know when there is a ceiling, so you can anticipate that. Uh, I'm both gonna fall. <laughs> well, sink. Okay. Uh, no way. <laughs> no way. Gotta do something like that. Ah, close. Yeah, you gotta time it when the Koopa's coming towards you. Wow, that's some pretty formidable platforming. <laughs> Holy moly. Ooh, I should have the mole shrine to say that. <laughs> okay, yeah, this... The jumps really aren't all that bad up until you get to these tight Koopa jumps. Mm -hmm. And I like jumping on Koopas when they're moving away. Because they're like moving in the direction that I'm moving and it just feels more like, of a confidence builder than if I were to jump at them while they're coming towards me. This one I probably want to jump on when it's low, yeah. Pick your Koopa jumps wisely. Very wisely. Alright, this one here. Uh, this one I'm going to have to do when it's coming towards me. Oh yeah! Like... Oh, pro. Oh, God, there's more. <laughs> okay, it's gonna, it's gonna come back, right? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah! <laughs> it's just so much pressure. Whew. All right. Oh, my goodness, it's not over. <laughs> when does this thing end? Oh, good lord. <laughs> just, just never-ending death. Everywhere. And since I've only got... Oh, it's over! It's really over! Yeah! I was gonna say, since I only have one hit, I could have to restart that whole segment at any time, but... Nope! It's 
done for good. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.